Hey guys, so um, this is going to be a really quick um, favorites video. It's going to be for January, February, and all that jazz. Um, I skipped over those months. I've just been really busy with school. Um, I just decided that I'll do this one now early. Most likely I'll be adding some more stuff, so I'll just have like a whole other clip like I always do. If you've ever watched any of my videos, I always forget things, so I just add stuff at the very end. So I'll just get in right, right into it because I have to actually go to work. I don't know if you see my Stila red carpet event thing we have going on um, today, which is Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. So I need to just get this all over the, uh, get this all over with, so I can go to work. Also, my nose is like runny and stuff like that, so I sound kind of nasally. Anyways, okay. So my first favorites are the Bosha um, skincare. I have this little kit. It has the soothing cleansing cream. Balancing Facial Tonic Vital Daily Moisturizer um, with SPF 15, Recharging Night Moisturizer, and the Blotting Tissues. I've been using a lot of this, and um, it hasn't broken out my skin any more than my face has been breaking out. I'm just I'm going through a lot of hormonal things, and stress, and whatnot. So, anyways, I really like that though, because um, there's not a lot of like fillers and crap for your face that shouldn't be in there. Um, next for powders, I really, I still love my Hello Flawless. Um, I don't know if I've shown you in a video yet or not, but I have, um, I Love Me Ivory. It's from Benefit. And then, I've been looking for some cheaper alternatives, so I love the NYX Stay Matte But Not Flat Powder Foundation. I have this one in Nude. It's really gorgeous. It has like a sheen to it, but, I don't know, it's like, it's matte, but it's not. And I really love it, and I've actually hit pan on it. I don't know if you can see, like, there you go. And then I've also been using this Physicians Formula Cover Toxin 50 Wrinkle Therapy Face Powder. Um, I used it just now in a um, foundation routine, and I really like it. It's got full coverage. Um, I love how it's smooth and silky, and you probably can't see that very well. But that's also from Physicians Formula, and it wasn't that expensive either. It was like nine bucks, so it's around the same price as everything. And this one's in translucent light. Um, for a highlighter, I've been really been liking the Wet n Wild um, Color Icon Bronzer, and this one is the lightest bronzer that they have. Reserve your cabana. So it just looks like this. I'm going to turn this over here so y'all can actually see something. Okay. And I like that. Um, and then I, whenever I want like a lot of highlight, I use these Sally's um, eyeshadows and either Champagne Snow. This one says gunmetal. I think this is wrong. I don't think that it's actually supposed to be gunmetal. So, let me scooch over for you guys. Okay. <laughs> and then, also, I've been liking the One Sweet from L'Oreal. Um, this is just the really light orange and taupey colors. There we go. And I like the taupey one for um, contouring, because you can't really tell that I'm contouring. It's very, very light. And then I've been liking the Prestige Brow Perfection, actually for eyeshadows. I don't use the wax part, but I use the three matte colors that they have for the brows for my lid. I actually have them on right now. They look more gray whenever they're all blended together, but I love it. Um, next, I've been liking a lot of things from Urban Decay. I've been liking Demolition, the brown um, eyeshadow or eyeliner pen, and then Urban Decay's uh, Urban Brow. It just keeps my brows in place as a clear gel. Um, I've been liking Perversion from uh, their 24-7 super black pencil they have now. And then, I think that's it for Urban Decay. God, I have like all this stuff all mixed up, sorry. I've been loving this. This um, you buy, um, blah, 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 blah. You get these from Walgreens. Um, they're really squishy. They're just like the beauty blender. And they're double-sided though, and I really like them. Um, I haven't cleaned this one since I started using it. So I'm going to do this. I'm going to do that. And then I've also been liking um, these two primers. I've used this before. Um, I thought it was why I was breaking out. It still could be why I'm breaking out. But I was using this. Um, in my foundation routine, I actually don't have a primer on. And then I also like this Dermablend Skin Perfector Pigment Correcting Primer. Um, it's really expensive. I've tried it for a while, and I didn't really see um, my spots lightening. So, I mean, it's a really nice primer. It's a really nice feel on the face, but I just didn't see anything really doing anything. I think I have to keep on using it a little bit longer. So, I'll have to do that. I still love 
for my foundations, I love Revlon Color Stay. I love Estee Lauder's Double Wear and Estee Lauder's Double Wear um, Maximum Cover. I actually mix this with Revlon Color Stay, so it's not so thick, um, but it's still really heavy coverage, and you it's really heavy on the face. I mean, you can tell that you're wearing makeup, so you probably wouldn't like this. Um, also, I like this e.l.f. Makeup Mist and Set. I actually sprayed this before and after I put on my makeup, and it makes this stay a lot longer, and that's why I actually use that in place of the primer. Um, I still love my Prestige Blackest Lashes. This has been my favorite mascara for, God, like half a year, if not longer. So, I love this, and I'll keep getting it. Um, this is like my third or fourth one. I don't know, I love it though. Also, I love the NYX High Definition Eyeshadow Base. It's my favorite eyeshadow base that I've tried so far. I've tried Urban Decay, I've tried Too Faced Shadow Insurance, and I actually like this one more than any of them. So, and it's cheaper, so that's always a plus. Um, my favorite lipstick at the moment is um, Smashbox Electric Pink. And it looks like this, and it was not cheap. Um, it's like $19 to $22, depending on your Ulta or wherever you get it. Um, and it's a super hot pink matte color. I love it. I've actually worn this quite a bit and I'm going to wear it today. Right now I don't have it on my lips because I just have this watermelon um, glossy lip color from Giordana. It's the like $1.99 lip colors that you can get at Walgreens. And I, I have that on just because I just want something like kind of sheer. And then whenever I work the event I'll definitely have something a little bit more bright. Uh, I just didn't want to like overall them you guys. And then I also like the Stila Mango Crush Lip and Cheek Stain. I actually like it more on the cheeks than I do the lips. And it gives like a really pretty, um, like glowy, like flushed look to the skin. I don't know. I just, it's amazing. And wherever I got it, it was actually only $12. So I was really happy because um, I didn't want to spend as much as it was, like 20 something dollars. And then I only had to spend 12 So that made me happy. Um, oh yeah, the other Urban Decay thing that I had was the 24-7 um, Lip Pencil in Illegal. I think I mentioned this in my last favorites video. It's still one of my favorite lip liners of all time. And then I also like the e.l.f. Mineral Blush in Bliss. Looks like that. It's a really pretty color. It again, gives that kind of like sheen, glowy look without being too over the top. And it's not like glittery. I like that. I also love the Vaseline Lip Therapy. It's so cute. It's so little. It's so little. Look how little that is. And I, I like this as um, like a lip balm. I could also use this on my face, but um, I tried out Alba's on Petroleum on my face. It's a little thick, and I don't think I've ever tried. No, I've never tried Vaseline on my face like regular with Petroleum. So I'm gonna see how that looks. And how it feels because I really wanted something that was kind of like dewy looking for my face, like to use underneath foundation. So I think I'll try Vaseline next time. I'm kind of scared too, but I'll try it. I also love um, the matte. Um, oh my god, the matte top coat <laughs> from War Paint Beauty. This is something you get at um, Hot Topic, and just matte. And it's actually how I got my fingernails to be matte. I actually showed that in um, my foundation routine video that I just did. Um, I also love these Icebreakers Frost. These have been around for a really long time. And I just tried them after my boss um, gave me some one day. And I was like, oh my god, like I love these. And I use them all the time. Now this is like my second box. So um, then I like this Sonia Kashuk, uh, just like the crease brush. And this was like five something. It's my favorite eyeshadow brush at the time. I use it for everything that I do on my eyes. So I did this whole thing with just this brush. And then for brows, I like the Essence Eyebrow Designer in light brown. It's only like 99 cents or 79 cents or something for this. And it just, just does my brows. Just does my brows. And then I will be doing a whole video on um, this line that's from um, Hot Topic. I actually bought like a crap ton, a crap ton, a crap load, a load of crap. I brought, I bought a lot of stuff from this brand um, just because they were like a regular five dollars and then I found them for a dollar ninety nine each. So I went crazy and I bought all this 
stuff, which actually isn't that much if you consider how much people buy makeup wise. But I did get a lot of lip glosses. Hold on, there's one that's missing. There's one that's missing. Hmm. I've lost it. And not just my mind. Okay, anyways. I got this reddish one. Oh, my camera's about to die. A purple one, pink one, and a light pink. Ah! Then I got this blue eyeshadow. <laughs> this green liner. A blue liner. You know, I'm just going to finish up with the word paint stuff whenever I actually have to do that video. So, um, also got these Sonic the Hedgehog headphones that are, like, super cool. They have little Sonic heads. They're amazing. And then I also like the Lorac lip gloss and Chuck. It's my favorite one that they have. They're very, very sweet, kind of like cotton candy and a bunch of other sweet stuff. So I got to go because my camera's dying. Oh, my God. Bye. Bye. Sorry. Bye.